Hey everybody, Goldie here, and today we are taking a look at what's coming up in WWE Champions. This week it is Ring In the New Year, post created by Scopely, today, January 1st, Ring In the New Year. Happy New Year. Thank you for being our champions all these years. Smiling face with three heart emoji. Your passion and dedication are why we are thrilled to work on exciting new features and improvements planned for this year and beyond, beginning with brand new Hall of Fame superstars and tokens. All caps, let's go! Imagine an air horn. Let's go. Uh, get a three-star bronze brand new X-Pac Hall of Fame for free in the shop. Log in daily to claim all necessary shards for a free four-star silver uh, fuse. I assume those shards will be in the shop as well. Collect enough shards to unlock Kevin Nash Hall of Fame. We did it, folks. We did it. We finally have a Hall of Fame Kevin Nash. Um, said nobody about X-Pac. Until the end of the Winter of Wonder contest or finish all midweek contests for a guaranteed three-star gold poster of him on the prize wall. So my assumption is the last four weeks of the every weekly midweek contest, if you, if you max the milestones, you'll get a medallion. Four medallions gets you the three-star gold poster. But I'm assuming that his shards will be available in other ways as well. So it looks like two routes to get him. Uh, this is new. Every new Hall of Fame superstar will require all new three-star, four-star, and five-star Hall of Fame gold tokens to evolve. So we've had bronze since the beginning of time. Now we have gold as well. You will find them and tons of regular Hall of Fame tokens for your superstars throughout the upcoming contest and offers. Uh, my initial thought on this, I'm not sure why we needed another currency, but um, is there going to be a way, like, is, this, is it like Hall of Fame 2.0 that the, all these new Hall of Famers going forward are going to use these instead? Is there a way to indicate that when looking at the card art or poster for a newer player, is there a different Hall of Fame link? Are we going to be able to possibly trade in our older tokens um, for some kind of ratio similar to Six Star Evolves? Lots of questions there, uh, but important to note that there will be something new coming. Uh, please note screenshots are taken from a test environment. Text numbers and dates are subject to change. Uh, schedule. So let's ring in the new year with a showdown because honestly, who needs blitz? Uh, ring in the new year starting January 2nd at noon Pacific, ending January 6th with a male female showdown tournament for five whole days. All right. Solo contest. Compete in the showdown tournament and the limited time tours to earn a Hall of Fame token chest and New Year's exclamation point balls. Climb higher in milestones for the brand new X-Pac Hall of Fame gold gear. Okay, so opportunity to earn gold gear for the freebie. Uh, Kevin Nash Hall of Fame shards and more New Year's balls, exclamation mark balls, which you can redeem on the ring in the new year prize wall for Hall of Fame gears. So there is a cap, once again, to Showdown Coins. The limit will be 87,500 at 29 points per coin. Uh, unlimited spend, to the surprise of nobody, uh, 6,000 per loot coin. Spend your first Ring of the New Year loot coin. Um, gives you 10K on the first day, resets and increases daily. And then unlimited talent up for X-Pac Hall of Fame, but if he requires the new tokens, I imagine we will be capped similar to Santa Hogan at the beginning, unless you want to do a heavy spend. Uh, contest characters for the week-long showdown. Ultimate Warrior, Godfather, Lita, Undertaker, Snoop Dogg, China, Wendy Richter, Andre the Giant, and Trish Stratus, all of which are the Hall of Fame versions 
five matches with each. Ultimate Warrior gets the big points with the 20k, everyone else 3k because Warrior is behind a ridiculous paywall, so makes sense that he's worth more. Uh, regular rewards will be um, New Year's balls that you can redeem on the prize in the prize shop. There will be medallions. Um, earn this medallion in the top three milestone of January's midweeks. Okay, so this is the um, midweek contest medallions for maxing out. This is what you can expect. 20 New Year's Hall of Fame token chests. Not sure if it's going to be like, get one of the following of a three, four, or five star. No idea how that's going to work. Uh, the Winter of Wonder Hall of Fame medallion. Standard set of tokens. 6 million coin, 380 TP. Additional rewards, so the bonus stuff when you spend. You can get the gold gear for X-Pac. Again, he is the freebie. Up to 750 Kevin Nash Hall of Fame shards. 66,000 New Year's balls. 15 Hall of Fame token chests. A five-star bronze Hall of Fame Andre. Nice. Um, and then a bunch more tokens. Uh, 40 Ezekiel shards for those of you still interested. There's 40 in that. Uh, leaderboard rewards, uh, token medallions, token cases, and New Year's balls. Uh, New Year's talent up competition. This answers the question of were we going to get a January talent up? The answer is yes. Talent up your Hall of Fame superstars for 1 million ring in the New Year contest points. Brand new Xbox Hall of Fame silver gear a legendary Xbox Hall of Fame strap, and resources. So completing Talent Up gets you silver gear for the free character, and then grinding out the showdown or spending will get you the gold gear. So we'll see how good he is with the one and two additional gears, and obviously how good he'll be without it. Uh, so League 7 and up, this looks to be a full-blown Talent Up. Um, increased roster talent, increased talent to Hall of Fame, involve... Evolve, Enhance, or Fuse, 2, 3, 4, 5 star. Spend your tokens. Send a 6 star bronze token. Still no method for Evolve, Enhance, or Fuse up a 6 star, but the 6 star tokens do count. Uh, Hall of Fame tokens, max of 75 million coin for a top milestone of 225 million. Rewards, again, that silver Hall of Fame X-Pot gear. Ring in the New Year contest points. A skill plate picker medallion. Reminder, the uh, Heroic Titans crest is on that wall now for 10 medallions. So if you don't have one, consider saving. Uh, the legendary Xbox strap is 20% gem damage, similar to an MLC freebie. Five random straps, 10 random tier 5 medals, strap parts, metal bits, headliner trips, yay, and uh, diamonds. Talent Up Leaderboard Rewards is going to be a handful of these new tokens. Limited Time Tours. Complete the chapters in this Limited Time Tour to earn Ring in the New Year Contest Points, Winter of Wonder Solo Contest Points, and new Hall of Fame Gold Tokens. So have no fear if you still need regular MLC points. We got a whole month to go. This is just going to be on top. So uh, Monday, similar to when we get our kickoff tour, X pack in the new year rump that mm, furpo. You tried. Uh, similar to the the freebie tour, three star for normal, four star for hard, five star for hell. So spend and get the extra stuff to the surprise of nobody. Tuesday, Hall of Fame class clash requirements. All classes contest superstar, any Hall of Fame. So if you only have Lawler, or if you only have Piper, or if you only have Eddie, for some reason, um, you'll be fine. If you have Lawler and Nikki, that's all you need. Rewards will be the new tokens and some points. Uh, 96,000 solo points for the MLC. Uh, 10,000 keys, 100 Evo tokens, no Ezekiel shards, important to note. Um, the prize wall. Holy gears. Okay. Collect New Year's balls in the solo contest and redeem them for Hall of Fame gears. That is a lot of gear. Available gears and their boosts. 
Um, I don't think I need to read all. Is this everybody? I think this is everybody. The yeah, wow. Okay, so if you're missing some Hall of Fame gear, this is your spot. Uh, Yoko with two with both gears is nasty. Andre needs both of his gears to get all that drip plate goodness. So there's that. Um, China for people that did the trivia grind for her. Trap gem uh, damage and then more color gem generation. I think silver gear is probably a fine enough place to stop for her. Unless you're doing the black build um, with a drip plate. Uh, Hall of Fame Iron Cheek. I still thoroughly enjoy... You only need one of the gears to get that plus seven. So coveting his silver gear, if you have him, might not be a terrible idea. There's a lot of the MP gears. Multi-strength again for Sheik. Um, Bret Hart has the multi-gem damage and then 20% gem defense for the gold. Uh, starting MP. Starting MP. Gold Snoop gear. Not terrible. I'm sure the the uh, prices. I wouldn't assume that these are all accurate. They'll probably change based on rarity. But uh, check out your Hall of Fames. See where you're at. Take your time making that decision because, as you can see, there is a lot to choose from. Offers and five star gold loot. Fireworks are going off for the brand new X Pac Hall of Fame. Get him up to five star gold alongside other top tier superstars to ring in the new year. Um, he's alongside Ultimate Warrior. More exclusives on the portal, including Hall of Fame starter special. So we're basically getting like a, it's basically like an MLC start. It seems like starter packs, tours, etc. And that's the blog, ladies and gentlemen. So let me know your comments and all your thoughts, any questions. Um, again, I'm reading the same blog post as everybody else. I don't have inside information. I can't tell you what the rest of the month is going to look like. I only have this. Um, I am curious to hear what everyone thinks about the new tokens. How do we feel about finally getting a Hall of Fame Kevin Nash? I know we're not going to talk about X-Pac because I won't allow it. Um, noted X-Pac unfan here. Um, but... We're still getting our Hall of Fame event, babies. Still getting our Hall of Fame event. Let me know again if you have any questions, comments, concerns. Again, I don't have inside information. I'm just the reader, but thank you very much for taking the time to watch this video. Be sure to like, share with your friends, and subscribe so you're notified when my next gameplay video or blog reading comes out. And happy 2023, everybody. I wish nothing but happiness, health, wealth, love, joy, laughter. Let's have a fantastic year as a community.